But I love I, I love Kobe over anybody. Yes, sir. Remember when we went to the game and he, get, he gave us. Hey, when we went to the Lakers game, then he looked out and he off. gave us the shoe. He, he took his shoes off and gave it to him. On me, I told him like before the game, me and Shady, you know, we of course like we young, dudes out, we on the feet up. Females, I ain't we ain't gonna use the word, but females out everything. He came over, he was like, What's up, bro? I'm like, hey, I need them, I need them shoes after the game, bro. You know, I was like, this is McCoy, McCoy, you know, I'm gonna introduce yeah. the after the game, I swear, bro. They they that's rock. not true. I didn't, bro, I didn't <laughs> say he didn't know. Yeah, I, hold on. McCoy, Yo, that's not true. Hold on, hold on. What are you talking about, bro? You talking right, no, about that's not true. I'm, I'm, saying, not I'm, true. I'm not calling you a liar. I'm just saying you might not remember it was a long time ago. First of all, me and him sitting down, right? We see he make eye contact. We like, oh, us, Kobe, he on the other side. At halftime, bro, we didn't talk to him. Some people came over and- Who said and, we talked to him at halftime? I said before the game. He shook our hand before the game. What are you talking we about? We ain't talked to him before the game, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 so after the game we talked to him? Hey, oh, this on tape. This on tape. This bro, is I, live. Yeah. I talked to him. What are you talking about? All right, well, man, all right so maybe he, all right, maybe he talked to him. I wasn't there. Crazy. So it's what's the story? So wait, so wait, so what's the story? I, never, I don't even care about the story no more, Oh, no, no, I'm saying, I just, What's wrong with you? It just happened differently. You know what I mean? Oh, my stomach, dog. <laughs> oh, my stomach. That's my brother, though. It's so, all your matter, bro. Yeah, this one matter. sound better. Yeah, it sound like he took the shoes off my ear. It was like, here, y'all. <laughs> I didn't say he took him out. He gave him his shoes, oh, bro. I said he he signed him and gave oh, him to us. He said game. that you said you said that. Mamba, he didn't do that. He didn't do that. <laughs> Mamba. I, I didn't say I didn't say he did that, bro. We had to fight to get a meal. Yeah, wrongfully accused. We had to fight to get a pill. That's why we right to get a deal. He on the team. He gotta eat, you know. Spike your skills. Fat. Keep it riding for the fam. You gotta like the we get wheels straight up. But in the past, bad work up in the trash bag. I'll pass a lot to take the test before I pass. Class. Yeah. And my family needed bread, I had to come correct That's why I keep airing it out like I just passed gas hey. I had to run to the gas station, grab me some of these sauces, right? You got a deal on these uh, folks for one? Jerry, can you hear me? I was asking what flavors you want, they got the watermelon Is that a package deal? No, because I like the peach you want two grapes? I'm gonna get a peach. They got a grapefruit. Right. And these help you burn fat too. And it's essential energy, so essentially it's, it's, it's good for you. Ain't no preservatives in it. Really, they got anything you want. They got an orange pomegranate too. Gerald. Yeah. There's two more of these, two more games. That's a double dribble. It's a double dribble. This game and then we on? Okay. What's up, what's up, what's up? you good? All right, y'all on that? Okay. So man, first off, appreciate you coming on the nah, show. This was cool, though. It took cool. it took a, it took D Jack to get you on the show because for about a year I'm asking it. No, nah, the time it, it was off because I was you know. But the time was right for Jack. I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got the Jack. Jack got the political <laughs> right away. Yeah, no, no doubt. Like, nah, I was damn. like, yeah. And then he, I look up like I, you know, I'll be like, yeah, I, you know, I'll be wanting to fuck with y'all. I fuck with y'all. I fuck with y'all show. Right, you know, I, I right. watch it. I see y'all. You know, you know, I fuck with y'all. I support y'all. I peep it on YouTube and all that. So I, I, I've been wanting to, you know, it just stuff, so how stuff you, was just coming up. How do you all. decide to reply or not? Because you know you'd be like left on red. People <laughs> see the room. No, they no. See the what you mean? How you left on? You was texting me. It wasn't <laughs> through Instagram. You was texting me. No, nah, I'm messing with you. It's crazy. Like I'm just meeting this dude, but I feel like I've been knowing. Who, Paul? Yeah. This is like, the first time meeting Paul. Yeah. He used to f my Lakers up. So like you ever like love cold? He, L.A. though. And, that's what's sick. Then, like, like, that's, I, I knew that. He from L.A. <laughs> So it's like, it's like I know you from killing us, but I don't really like it. Right, right, but right. But you like respect it. Oh, man. Next year we get the Yeah. Bro was nice. Yeah, was he? Yeah. And he had like a slow game too. That, uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm going right. to tell y'all the coldest We lost in 2010. Okay. Yeah, yeah, The yeah. second time around we played and we lost. So I'm out in Calabasas. That's where I'm living. I go to uh, Johnny Rockets with my homeboy. So it's a normal day, summer. I go to Johnny Rockets and I get a burger. I'm sitting at the counter, eating my burger. This kid come in. I'm seeing him. He come in with a big ass Laker flag, right? <laughs> I'm talking about <laughs> this big dog. He got it on his shoulder, and he was like, "Hey, uh, Paul, can you sign this for me?" I said, 
If you don't get in my face, <laughs> I'll slap you. I got so hot, dog. I was so hot. Well, how old was he, though? Man, he had to be like a little 12-year-old or something, dog. Oh, he know better. Yeah. Man, he was like, can you sign this for me? This was right after we lost. Right. Oh, man, I was so hot, dog. So you never uh, thought about, you never thought about, like, coming home and playing for the Lakers? Mm. I mean, that was always my dream. You know what I'm saying? Growing up right here. I grew up down the street from the Forum. Uh, you know, but it was never opportunity. I never had the opportunity because, like, when contracts came up, it was like, all right, be a free agent or take that extension. And you know, when you, when you, when you got that extension in front of you, you're like, oh, hell no, I ain't never had no bread. I got to sign this. Right, right. So that's going to take you the way the uh, NBA is. You got the rookie deal. It's like you there for the first four years under rookie deal. So then after your third year, you can assign extension, which was another five-year deal. Mm -hmm. So I signed that. So that took me to year nine. And I was just like, damn, you know, I was, it was a point to where I was ready to get out of there when we was losing. You know what I'm right. saying? I was like, man, this ain't it. You know, I, I need to find a better situation. But then, you know, we retooled KG, we traded for KG and Ray, and, Ray, and that was it. That, that, that's crazy, too. You spoke on that. So, like, I look back at that being the big three, that, that air right there, like you said, you, KG, started, and, kicked it and, off, and huh? Ray. I feel like y'all really started the big three because now you got everybody cl cl like clicking up. You got LeBron, Chris Bosh, D Wade. Like, talk about that a little bit. Playing with KG and Ray, like, what was that like? I mean, dog, like, I at that point I never played with nobody at that level. Right. You know what I'm saying? And KG been MVP and Ray, he already recognizes the greatest shooter. So they come in, and I already knew KG from high school. You know, I didn't know Ray. And it was just like, we made the trade. We just kicked it off instantly, though, because we was all at the same point in our career. We like, I'm in my 10th year. Ray and this like 11th or 12th KG the same. And we ain't won. You know what I'm saying? We out here. We out here making the all-star game and this and that. But, you know, we trying to win it. And so we just at the point in our career, like, look, man, we going to drop these egos. You know, I don't give a who the best player that night. We just trying to win. You but did y'all set that up? It was like, no, nah, we did it through trade. See, ours was different. Right, that's what different I'm getting how to. They right, right. Free agency, you see a trade. That's look how I went. Look how I went. We was the worst team the year before. I got hurt, broke my foot, so we we lost hella games. So, we was in line for the number one pick okay. in the draft, and that pick would have been Kevin Durant. Word. Yeah. That's cold. Look, look, Both look, look, look. <laughs> So we didn't get the number one pick, and we had the best chance to get the number one pick. We end up with the fifth pick which is like the worst scenario could have happened. So we trade that pick and get Ray. We was like, all right, we're going to trade that pick and get Ray. And we had all young pieces around me rebuilding. So mm -hmm. we was like, all right, we got Ray now. So I'm like, all right, we serious about winning. Sure. So then we gathered up some more draft picks, a couple more young players. We're going to trade all y'all. We trade like nine people for KG. Got him a You, 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 And then, then that's, the, that's how it went down. You know what I'm saying? So it's different now. These cats, they they friends. They they kick it in the summer. They play in the Olympics together. Yeah. Drew Lee. And, and, and I don't even knock that. I, I think it's dope what they do. You know, they built their relationships because before it was more like, you know, you know, I'm, I'm trying to beat you. Now they they clicking up, doing businesses off the court, right? Playing together on the court. It, it, it's a different time and era. And at first I wasn't feeling it, but it, it is what it is. But you don't think that like that part of the game? See, I feel you on that, but. Some of it is like the competitive nature it's gone. in the game. It's like it's gone. It's gone. Yeah. You think it's gone? Yeah. I don't think. It ain't the same, though. Man. Think about that. Y'all watch the y'all watch NBA, and I watch that. I, I can only name if five players that I feel like is competitive in the league. In name the your five. Name the Giannis, five. Giannis. Yes, yes. Draymond. Yep. Uh, uh, Westbrook. You like, you know, they play hard. You know, right. regardless. Like, regardless. Regardless. Yeah. Uh, Patrick Beverly. And probably like Luca don't play hard. I mean, he play hard, but it's a certain cut. You know that Kevin, dog. Kevin, hold on, Kevin Durant though. I mean, you know that dog type mentality that John, you see. John Morant. John Morant got it. John Morant got it. But dog he can be it. different though. Yeah. Can we say that? Cause, cause like dog can be, like like in football terms, like a, like a dog for, uh, Marshawn Lynch. Yeah. His dog compared to a dude like Marshall Falk's dog. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, if I, yeah, if yeah, I put no, Kevin sure. Durant in there. Well, I mean, I think I feel like you say dog. Dog is like, yo, he can go. But when you say, when you look at somebody and say, yo, he a dog. Like, yeah, I feel he, that he too. That, yeah, it, like, it depends on the tone. Too. Right, right. Like, I feel that too. Like, like, yeah. Like, Giannis is a dog. Yeah, yeah, right, right. He <laughs> a big dog. 
<laughs> like he one of them pimps. I said, you, you say because he play physical, right? Is that what it is? When I look and I say you a dog, it look like you ain't got no friends out there. Right. Oh, mm, yeah, you know yeah, 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 yeah. You ain't, you you ain't smiling at nobody. Whoa. You ain't dapping cats. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like KG was a dog. Yes, he was. You know what I'm saying? So Josh, your number one, you, you said his name a lot. He, I think he's the best player right now. I think he's the best player in the league right and, now. And is that because KD's not healthy and KD? No, KD you? is nice. I mean, he's a unicorn. But the way Giannis changed the game on both ends of the court, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? He, he on defense, uh, he can guard all the positions, he rebound, he can score at will, and he just dominant. I mean, KG, he gonna, KD going to give you the scoring every night consistent, right. capable of 30-40. He's not the defender Giannis is. He's a great defender, right. but he don't impact that side like Giannis do. In, your, in, in they prime, you taking LeBron or Giannis? LeBron, for sure. I mean, LeBron led. He didn't. He he he. he didn't, you put LeBron with four bums. He didn't took them to the finals. Right. You know what I'm saying? Did Did you feel that way when when he uh, left Cleveland and and got to Miami? Was that a real like? Because I, I really want to dive in this conversation. Like, is that was that real beef? Was that real beef? Was that a real rivalry? <laughs> you know what I'm was saying? Was it real smoke? <laughs> I, I mean, I just I wasn't ready to crown him yet. You know, I mean, I'm not crowning no younger. Who he got to because he, he got to show me. This is the thing. This is when I first heard about LeBron. I was in the All-Star game. This was 2002, my first All-Star game. And there was a lot of buzz around LeBron then. And they was like, yeah, it's this kid. This one, everybody was going to see him. Jay-Z, cats was flying up. NBA players was going to see this kid in high school. Was there, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. They was, I was like, like what, who is this? So we had the All-Star game. They was like, yeah, it's this kid in high school right now that can play in this game. And I was like, what? In the All Star game, yeah, like, that hold on, what they talk about. I swear to God, the locker room was like, "It's a cat in high school that can play in this game." Think about that. They didn't say make it to the NBA. They said he can play in the All Star game. game, like right now. I was like, "Hold on," and, and they didn't have no Instagram, so I could just look. Let me just, you know, let me see where he, if you had to go see him. Yeah. And so, you know, he coming to the league. I was like, "Man, let's see what this is about." You know what I'm saying? So I'm going at him. I mean, we I'm going at him early. You know, we dropping each other off 40, boom, boom, boom. And it just, I wasn't ready to like call a, a young cat 21, 22 king. You know, he gonna have to earn this. For sure. And I think I was able to push him. You know, you know, I, I, he he was gonna be great, but I know I pushed him to another level. To, to another level because he had to go to that next level because uh, I, I wasn't backing down. I, I think I seen something like that where um. When most players was giving him his, his credit so early, yeah. and I witnessed, I seen you said something like, "I mean, like, like we not we ain't, we ain't scary Lebron. We don't we don't fear Lebron." Yeah. Well, I feel like everybody was was already giving him his love. And I think that comes from a different era. Yeah. Where now we don't see that. Yeah. So like like you uh -uh. and KG, I'm not sure what Ray how his attitude was, but but from my eyes seeing it, you and even KG, Rondo, and Rondo, they had like dogs to him. <laughs> Man, Nasty. our whole team, dog. Look look at look at our whole team. Tony Allen. Tony dog. Allen was another dog, dog. yes. Perkins, dog. You're yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> oh, 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 baby, baby, big baby. Big baby, baby dog. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Time out. Big baby? You ain't giving baby that? And y'all out of pocket for saying dogs. We said, yeah, y'all tripping. I think he a dog. He said, they like dogs. No, baby dog. No, baby dog. Baby dog. Baby dog. Yeah, yeah, baby out dog. Out of shape, baby dog. He was not no dog. He wasn't a big dog. I he was a baby dog. I watched him cry all the time. And, and, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, y'all getting crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm with you. I asked him the question. I ain't with him. He a dog. dog. I, I would dog. say he a baby dog. He like, he, you wouldn't put him on a dog with, with PG. Don't nobody want to throw hands with baby. That ain't, that's different. Yes, come on. Yeah. And baby won't smoke. Yeah, period. He won't smoke. But I'm saying, why you say he not a big dog? Because he was, cause he was younger? I or I just because you seen him cry? I've never seen that too. I've never <laughs> seen no dog moments. Everybody named, I seen, I seen Rondo show me dog against Chris Paul. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, right, I, I, I saw, I, I see him give me dog uh, multiple times. I see KG, first of all, he my favorite. I love KG. Take it. The best story, <laughs> you gotta tell me about this story though. Is it true? Wow. They said, uh, Jakeem Noah, was like a big fan of KG. He said, yo, I'll dog, get off my nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that. Nah, he didn't say it like that. He didn't say it like that. He said it a lot harder than that. We at the free throw line. KG right here, Noah right here, and I'm right here. So, you know, KG intense. He he, he looking down, he's dripping sweat. He like, hey, yo, KG, man, you was my favorite player, dog. <laughs> I had your poster on my, on my wall. And right, he telling him all this, he breaking it down. KG was like, get off my 
And then he yeah. said, hey. he said, and dude jumped. I look, I, I look. So I'm right here, like, I'm like, ooh, okay. <laughs> I was told that during the game. Dog, this is yeah, in the game. Somebody at the free throw. free throw line. Dog, and I'm like, oh man, he the man. You can't talk to KG right now, dog. We yeah, in the middle, we in the yeah. middle of the, oh, of the thick. You can't. Who was the dude in the locker room? Was it was it you? Was it Doc? Like if KG went too far, you know, because there's some moments where he probably went a little too far. Who was that person that reeled him back in? I think I was the one that reeled him back in all the time. You know, I was this guy knowing him from young. That respect. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, we used to go at it sometime. Definitely. I used to yell at him. And he'll yell back though. I'll be like, all right, all right. That's why I'm just making sure. You yeah, know, right. we, we had that respect though. It never went overboard. Respect. But we could yell at each other and be like, come on, man, you gotta right. woo woo woo. You gotta get on point. Right. And we can talk like our team was like that. Like we weren't afraid to call each other out. And, 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 and it was and it was all love at the end of the day, because after every game, we gonna meet. But we'll sit just like this after the game, after the meeting's over, after everybody. Just uh, politics. And just politic after the game. Like, what you think we could have did better? Uh, you know, that's, why that's leadership. Good. Right that's why they were so good. <laughs> yeah, that, and we, we'll talk just like that. We'll do like 10 minutes every game like this, win or lose. I mean, it's interesting, bro. So I just want to talk about the NBA champion year, bro. Like, when y'all in 2008, bro, y'all won the, you know, you, you, the, the, the finals. Y'all won the championship, bro. And you got yeah. NBA finals MVP, bro. Yeah, like, that was just... I'm, I'm really interested to see, like, what, what was that year like for y'all? Like, you said, like, that's a big moment from you growing yeah. up right here in the city, bro. No, and then playing against Lakers, though. You feel what I'm saying? Like, yeah, come on, you got to you gotta let wild. me on that. Because I remember, so I, I, you know, you big bro to me. You my OG, man. You came, you showed the way, you paid the way for me, bro. So, like, let the people know what man, that was like, that was, bro. that was unreal, dog. I mean, it was just like a dream, you know. you. We, I remember we won, and then, you know, we playing against Cole. We playing against the guy, you know. Cole, yeah. you know, you know everybody put Cole back, you know, up there with MJ. So to go out there and guard him and get the best of him, that, that's like, come on. You know, that, that was like, phew. I always tell people, look, I had to go through LeBron and Kobe in the same year. Like in the I same think prime, year. though. And they prime. Right, they prime. Right. <laughs> right. Was it the old LeBron? Right. Oh, no. was it though? Like, take us like, with, with, like, with Jack saying, you know, when, we, when you play ball, you can go back to like yeah. sitting in the locker. Yeah. Right before give the me game. game clock, all that rundown. Yeah, like yeah. game plan. Yeah, like, like that. That was a different experience, bro. Cause Kobe? I remember I was sitting there like watching every game. What y'all went six games? Yeah, we won six. Four games. two. Cause you're yeah, not even playing. Like, it's not just the game. It's not even just the game on the court. It's the game in your mind too. Like I'm going to. It was Kobe. game three. So like game three. I remember game three. You know, in LA. In, in LA. Yeah. In yep. LA. So, you know, it could be kind of intimidating playing in the, in the Staples because, like, Jack you, got, you got Jack, Floyd, Mayweather Denzel. over there, Denzel right there. <laughs> like, damn, right. Bro, okay. They all right. It's hard playing for I mean, them lights get bright. Yeah. yeah. Them lights get bright in L.A., dog. And I remember I was at the free throw, and, I, and Floyd yelled out something. You know, at the free throw, they, I said, I looked at him, and this just turned, just, just turned me on. It just turned me up. He yelled, I don't even remember what he said, but I know I looked at him like, I said, what the f you say? Like, oh yeah, he meant that. <laughs> what? Yeah. And, then he, and then I think he was like, nah, P, I'm with y'all. And I was like, oh, all right, that turned me up. <laughs> I said, all right, I was kind of like, what? Like, he said, nah, I'm with y'all, P, I'm betting with y'all. And I was turned up after that. And then after that, I remember I went in the locker room, I said, I want cold, because Ray was guarding me. Cause Cole was like, I felt like he, he was lighting him. <laughs> I mean, he was going, but I was like, I, I know a scorer's mentality. I think the first half, and me being a scorer, I was like, Cole was like, he wasn't lighting us up yet. But I know that mentality. I know if I have a bad first half, he gonna, he gonna come out second half. Like he gonna come out. So at the halftime, so I looked at the stats. I was like, all right, he gonna come out swinging. So I was like, that's I want Cole, because I know he gonna try to come out and go for like 50 second half. And I wanted that. I wanted that, dog. It, it was just something. I just wanted it. I don't know. I just, you know, being a scorer, I know I'm going to come out second half, and I just th try to think like I'm him. Like, you know, let me guard this. But how you guard Cole, though? Right. You know what I'm saying? What was your, what was your my game thing, plan? My <laughs> game plan was just like. It's just Cole. <laughs> well, it was, it was a different, like, in they offense, Cole posted up a lot. Yeah. You know, so in that triangle. And I was like, you know, I can take that part of his game away. He ain't gonna be in the post. Cause you up. big, yeah. Big, yeah. I'm gonna be swiveling you, like yeah. moving you. Man, you thirsty. I'm strong. Like, Use oh, all yeah, your I'm antics. Gonna take that, I'm gonna take that part of your game. Oh. We ain't doing that. Right, right. 
we ain't doing, doing that part. Yeah. We're going to exit that because, you know, he get hot at that, that, that mid post. Plan B. Yeah. <laughs> I made him go to different stuff, you know, so it was like if you could just take that away because he was super effective right there. So I was strong and big and I was wearing him down. I was just wearing, I was leaning on him all game. I'm leaning on him, leaning on him. Finally, he tried, I'm leaning on him so much. He shoots his fade away, jumping, I blocked it. You know, I'm like, damn, I blocked a cold fade away. <laughs> <laughs> and so I think that changed the whole series right there. What, what, I got to ask Chris because I. I'm a huge Kobe fan, and I really didn't like you like that. Uh -huh. because, I hear that all the time. Because That's he was killing our Lakers. Not real talk. I'm a Kobe nut. <laughs> right. and, and we couldn't guard him. We couldn't guard him. My, my thing is, give me two Kobe memories, right? I want one from actually playing, maybe in them series, yeah, a couple of them, mm -hmm. and then one off the court. Well, the off the court one is easy. I remember. Man, you got to give us cut. something you ain't tell the people already. Let's see. One I ain't told. But this is the best one, though. This is the one we were shooting yeah, the commercial, best one. Yeah. though. Let's do it. <laughs> it's going back to the commercial. We, we shooting the commercial with other, with other players. And it's me and him matched up in the commercial. So, I mean, in the commercial, you know, you like, say like the commercial is me drinking this, but I'm not really drinking it. I'm like, right, right, right. Ah, you know, you're supposed to, you know, fake it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, all right, we want you to go make a move on Kobe, take the shot, whatever. So I'm like, all right, cool. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I'm going to make the move. Just knock the ball off my head. I'm like, no, what you doing? We're trying right. to get, we try to get the, <laughs> for the yeah, shot. Yeah. So I get it again. Are y'all cool at the time? Y'all cool? Yeah, we cool. Oh, we okay, cool. Okay, we cool. Okay, all right. All right, I get the ball. I wasn't thinking. I think he just around with that So I'm like, all right, boom. He knock it out again. I'm like, <laughs> like, what you doing? You tripping. So now, the third time, I got to go hard now. He, real, he really trying to play defense. Right. I'm like, dog, I didn't come up here for this. <laughs> so now I'm like, oh, damn. He wasn't going to let me get the shot. Like, they want to see me shoot the shot and make it, my right. dog. Like, <laughs> he really guarding me. Oh, oh, I was tripping off of that. I was like, damn, you really got to go hard everywhere. Yeah. With him. That's how hard he went every time. He was not feeling me. They didn't want, he didn't want he that didn't shot. He didn't want that shot to get off on that him. Shot. I, I think don't we went to something else. Yeah, I, mean, <laughs> I don't go. I'm going to do something else. <laughs> what, what about on the court? We playing in Boston. Playoffs? No, this is a regular season okay, game. Okay. This is a regular season game. It was a point. He put so much pressure on me. I think he shot the ball every single time down. He had like 40. Mm. He had about 40 something. <laughs> Every time, the, down, that no, sound no, like no, no, every no, time no, come down, every time come down. I look at the stat sheet. He took forty-one shots on me. Damn, <laughs> <I was> like, <laughs> personal. What you, I, what I, you yeah. do? That, you know, like you ain't took forty-one shots no, right. all year. <laughs> he coming to Boston, took forty-one shots on me. I was like, hold on, dog. He, like he was trying to just take my head off. Like he he was trying to go for eighty. Right. This before the the championship. This is before the championship. I was gonna this say, did it have anything to do with the commercial? No, no. Oh this, is before, this, is them, Kobe, right? this is before them years. We was going back and forth in the right. finals. This is like earlier. Yeah. Hey, look, I, I'm a I'm a Sixer fan, right? I'm gonna keep it one hundred because Eric, you, you you spoke about you talked about Ray Allen, you talked about KG Rondo, and then you said Doc Rivers. I mean, I know you you biased because you got this your man, but is he a good coach like that? I think so. Yeah, you know, Doc was at my wedding. You know, we talk about, like, I go in his office. I mean, he didn't put me in the office like, hey, look, you're going out too much. Yeah. Like, you know, like, <laughs> For real, not to keep it real. You just need to hear, like, on some like, yeah. yeah. Like, look, let me tell you this one story, though. So, look, I came in to practice one day. Okay. It's game day. So, the night before, man, I think I was up to, like, 6 in the morning kicking it. <laughs> it's I was, game day. <laughs> they so, do party. So, we got practice, I think, at 11. Man, I get there, all right, cool. So I'm on a wing, and we run a play. Throw the ball, I'm supposed to cut across the lane. I go to one knee. <laughs> <laughs> I go like this. He look up, so I look at him. Whooped out. Oh, I know my breath smell like patrol. Yeah, he whooped. <laughs> like, I'm whooped. You whooped. <laughs> I'm whooped. He come up, like, so look, he like, I'm looking at him, he like, Paul, come here. And so I go up, and I stop short, like, <laughs> you know what he said? He what? was like, go home, get some rest, and be ready for tonight. I was like, thank you. Oh, everything gone. <laughs> yeah. I ran out of there. I went home, slept it off, watered down, back. came back, had like 30. 30. He won. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Football and basketball is totally different, bro. Like, yeah. they regiments and how they get ready for gamers. No way in the world we could do that, bro. No, like, we no, got to no. go to pregame and be ready. They go six, seven, eight hours before the <laughs> but game. But I didn't make that Every a habit, though. Yeah. It wasn't a habit like that. I wasn't kicking it like that the night before the game like that. It was just one of them nights. 
You know, it's such a long season. We got long seasons. I ain't gonna lie though. I done yeah. hung out with a few NBA dudes though where like we go out the night before. Say we in off season, they in season, we go out, hang out. We in the club till three, four in the in the morning, drinking, get up, get into his room six in the morning, going to sleep, having to go through a shootout at what, like 10, 12? Yeah, but see, they don't do that. A lot of times they don't do that no more to shoot around. So now oh. it'll be like game at seven. All right, we'll, 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 we'll be on the bus at 5. Yeah. So if you get in at 2, 3 in the morning, you can sleep it off all day. Exactly. Right. Boom, boom, boom. Be ready. Get, just make sure you're on the bus at 5. Who went out with you? I know Rondo ain't go out with you. What? Rondo get it in. <laughs> Rondo get it in. <laughs> Rondo was out. Rondo was out. Actually, yeah, our whole yeah. team was out. Ray wasn't out. The whole team was out? Man, Ray, Ray won out. out. Yeah, you crazy. <laughs> Shut up, <laughs> we're crazy. Y'all <laughs> crazy. Yeah. Listen, hey, no, it's, no, different. it's different. It's different. Look. We play 82 games, dog. That's a game yeah, of games. Right, right, yeah. Dog, we got to have some fun, dog. Sure. Come on, it's a long season. And then y'all do got the, y'all got the way roll games. Man, oh, yeah, I'm yeah. Thinking that. We, yeah. We, we might go to Miami. Sure, we play Miami. Say like we just played Milwaukee on Thursday. Okay. And we got Miami on Sunday. We flying from Milwaukee to Miami. So now we got a couple of days to kick it yeah. in the city. Oh, yeah, lit. Man. It's I will always bet against teams that play Miami. Right. I will bet against you, them because I know I know they're going out. Yeah. Gonna be hey, out. Hey, you, you spoke with something serious. You said um like football will be different because it's a liability, right? Yeah. And, and I know you had a situation before where you got stabbed, right? Mm -hmm. I want to bring that back to the correlation with that and um, John Morant. He got with yeah. the gun and all that. Speak about That's that though, question. about liabilities, being safe. This is the thing, and I wish I had understood it uh, when I was that age, mm -hmm. you know, that when you young, black, and rich in America, you a target. Yes. You know what yes. I'm saying? And, and people don't like looking at you. You know, y'all look nice. We got the jewelry. This is our this is our culture. We dress right. like this. We want to come out and be fly when we got it and we get it. That's just us. That's right. And people don't like seeing that. Mm -hmm. and, and so you be a target and, you know, you don't really realize it, you know, when you first get in it. You know, as a young dude, and I definitely, you know, I was a product of some hate. You know, I'm talking to a chick and everything, and then some dude come up. Next thing you know, I'm in a squabble, you know, with like two or three different dudes getting stabbed on the ground. Like, like I thank God that I'm still here. Mm. Like, I knew I had purpose after that. And I, I don't condone what John Moran did, like, whatever, but I'm not going to judge him either. Right, right. You know, for one, it just seemed like once he did it, the next day everybody was crucified. Everybody, right? Yeah. And I was just like, dude, 23. I don't know how we know that's even really a gun right there, first of all. Because it did look, look like a little lighter. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Like how do we lighter, even yeah. know? But I understand the perception. And if he haven't done those other things, like the thing they say at the mall yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, or with the 17-year-old with the, uh, kid and everything, yeah. then this probably would have got swept under the rug a little different. And, and so in saying that, you know, you just got to be careful. You know, where you go, who you with, and, and how you move. And have understand, I started having security. Yeah, I was mm -hmm. paranoid. I was carrying a gun. Right. <laughs> but I wasn't showing nobody. I wasn't right. like, like, what, like, don't come near me. But I'm going to be tucked. But why, but why, why can't, why, why we got to go through our own mistakes instead of, like, learning from, like, your story? You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's, that's, like, when you talk about John Moran. I mean, that's not I realistic. But that's the question. Well, the thing I, is, we need, we need more of the OGs to, to be around them. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with that. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, look at his team. Who is hey, OG? Steven Adams. Yeah. And he yeah. can't relate, he can't relate. He can't he can't relate to him. Bro. I just don't said, understand that. We, Where's the support at? We, you know what I'm saying? Like, are the most targeted and the most scrutinized as black athletes. Right. Like, I talk about this all the time. Hockey players play a game and then they fight and everybody watch and they, it's cool. Yeah. Let that be in, a, in, in our one of oh, our yeah, sport. Right. Yeah. Like, oh, they, this is this is this is oh, what is this? this Hoodlums. Is, Hoodlums right, 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 yeah. You know, we we get into a fight, but in hockey, you look at them, they like, all right, the referees just stop and let them take the point, gloves yo. off. It's the same thing in ball too. Football, like point, we we <laughs> running you know twenty miles saying? per hour, smacking each other, pushing, doing all of that, and then we cross that line, yeah. fight a little bit. And, and Even then, the dress then, code. Yeah. I remember back then, because you was part of that, that yeah. they changed the dress code. That was, you know what that was all about. Yeah. You know what but, I'm but saying? The, but the, but the, the, the hockey thing, that's crazy. They fight. Yeah, like, they they drop like their this, jaws and fight. And they like watch for a little bit. Y'all can get off for a little bit. Yeah. But let that be one of our sports. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. barbaric. They've, they've changed. <laughs> right, 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 right. <laughs> but even think about baseball. They clear the bench. Yeah. They, they do clear, clear the bench. That's what I'm saying. Like the like whole however many of them rushing, rushing each other, da, 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 whatever. Let that, look how they label. 
the malice in the palace, how that was like. Yeah, yeah. They got suspended the whole year. Yeah, that's right. That's like, right. Like, you don't see that in no other that sports. Because we not. black. Exactly. We that's just what I'm telling you. Yeah. So let's get messy, man. I I, I, I kind of yeah. want to stir it up a little bit, man. <laughs> let's talk about the ESPN incident, man. When you was when you was working for ESPN and like it was a good time. Cause, cause you got fired because that, that shit was crazy, but you was not having still, a good time. I still like, still don't get it. Like, I mean, I got fired for what? On your day off. <laughs> <laughs> Friday on day off. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, yo, for what? Time. Oh, love. You know what you were doing. Hey, shorty, shorty, they look thick to him. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, if you gonna get fired, go on like that. Yeah. Man. I got fired by having some entertainment. Right. I'm playing cards. It's my boy's birthday. It's girls dancing. And we blowing some tree. Yeah. I, I mean, what did, what did I do wrong? That's what it was, though. It, it looked like, <laughs> hey, yo, can I say it? What it looked like, B? It looked like, like an orgy. Like a, <laughs> like, no, no, you had your shirt off. Huh? You had your shirt no, off. No, nah, I didn't. I didn't have my shirt, shirt off. off. I had my shirt off. But you was you, having you a good playing, time. You was playing cards. You was playing cards. Yeah, yeah, cards. Yeah, there's some like, girls around yeah, him. I mean, yeah, that was it. Who recorded it, though? Like, somebody? I did. I did. Oh, I did. He was John Moran. He was John Moran. <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm turned up. I'm on live. Like, yeah, he on live going yeah, crazy. Man. Oh, yeah. What's up, y'all? We out here. <laughs> he licking his lips and no, all that. Look, like. look, I'm getting a haircut, too. Yeah. I'm getting a cut. It's cracking. It's popping. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why. I don't know. I don't never go live either. Oh. I was just feeling my cut or something. And I was yeah. like, and then it was popping behind me. It was like, at <laughs> 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 the joints over there. Yeah, hey, dog, come on. Hey, I mean, but look. The hood was feeling me. I don't, I don't, I was everybody feeling, was related. Can, can, can we hear that? I got here. Can we hear the call? Yeah, the call. Yeah, 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 like, 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 ring, ring, ring. <laughs> no, no. So they hit me, and there's a, a higher up. Uh, it was a lady. <laughs> I'm like, hello. She's like, yeah, we're doing, you know, an investigation. I'm like, you know, could you tell us what happened? And I'm like, you didn't see it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was just. You saw that ass, baby. I was just. <laughs> <laughs> I was just hanging out. Uh, playing cards. It wasn't my house. Mm. Uh, I mean, it was self-explanatory. Right, you know, right. so, some, some girls dancing, and I was, you know, I had some OG. I mean, right. what? Right. And in LA, it's legal. Yeah. yeah, it's legal. Yeah, I didn't do nothing illegal. Illegal. But you know, at the end of the day, it's Disney. Mm. And, oh, it's Disney. That's and, right. and so they was like, you know, they have a morals clause, and it was just, you know, they just said it was, it was immoral. Right. Whatever. Come to Fox, baby. <laughs> you know he I wasn't even all that. I, I wasn't. I mean, the only thing I was mad at about the whole thing is like my daughter seeing Same. it. Oh. You, you know what I'm saying? Mm, like, yeah. you know, you don't want to give off that perception. And you know, I had to. You know, that's like that's how old is she? She 14. I got two daughters, 14, 11. I got a two year old, but and so that's the only conversation I felt. And so they was like, my agent hit me, mm -hmm. like, we need you to offer an apology. You know, da, 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 da. I was like, what am I apologizing for? Mm. You know, Did like, you apologize? No. That's what what? I was, Would that what have made a difference, though? What am I apologizing right, 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 for? Yeah, like, right, right, right. Sorry to what? Like, come on. All them CEOs who, who, who own these all networks, what you think they doing behind yeah, the scenes? Right, right. What you, and they probably got, got exactly. most going on. What, 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 it's like with, uh, what Jerry message? Jones always tell Pac, though, he say, look, you ain't doing nothing wrong, you're just doing it yeah, with your ass out oh, on the yeah. street. That's <laughs> right. the, like, that's the game. Right. Yeah. That's the game. I, I, I look right. at it from my point of view, so I'm curious to see, like, what lessons did you learn from it? Because yeah. I go back when I was young, the young DJ, it was a knucklehead, that hung out show, like you said, grab my phone, me and about 50 of my, we in pictures, throwing up yeah. game signs, like, for me, it was like, I should have did it behind the doors. Like yeah, you said, yeah. what the owners do. I, I was like, that was my lesson that I learned. Like, instead of showing everybody I'm from LA, we in the streets, we in the hood. When I pull up to Crenshaw on 42nd, this was going on. I like, right, once right. I got in trouble in 2013, I said, you know what? I got to take Move a step a back and right. stop showing it, bro. Because like nowadays, right. it's like what you put out there is a, is a perception of reality almost. So like, That's, did you learn absolutely. any lessons? Like you probably shouldn't have did. Absolutely. I, I'm telling you, it was all because of my kids. You, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I can't do like okay, they y'all might know PB on this or whatever, but he ain't gotta let y'all see it. Right. right you right. know, you can guess. Exactly. You, you know, whatever. And, and it's for them, mm. because at the end of the day, you know, as a father to daughters, you know, you you, you want to school them, you want them to respect you, uh, and so that's my only regret about the whole thing. Okay, yeah, did I do anything illegal? No. 
But at the same time, I made a mistake because my kids saw that. And so now sure. you got to always think of like, damn, they got to go to school because if they saw it, they friends see it. Right. That's right. That's right. And, and now they friends going to be at them. And so you got to constantly think like that, especially in my position. And so that's uh, I was like, so I had to really apologize to her and be like, you know, that that, that wasn't right. You know, I shouldn't have been on the, on the uh, thing doing all that. And I apologize if I'm embarrassing you. You know, you don't never want to see you embarrass your kids. Cause like your kids they, don't think you everything. Yeah. But but the the apology that maybe could have been to other fourteen year old girls or eleven year old girls. You know what I mean? Maybe if they was just trying to say like, if you apologize, would it be more for that? Because I don't think you did nothing wrong. But something like that, you just say about the fourteen year old daughter. I think about damn, damn, he got a ten year old daughter. He got mm -hmm. a maybe right. the apology to them type of thing. Yeah, it's apology to all the young girls. Yeah. You know, so I respect that more than I, just. I don't want them to the to the. I don't want to come off that I, and, and, and I don't want it to come off that I'm out here disrespecting women. Right, 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 right. You know, and I didn't do that on the on the yeah, on yeah, the on the tape. Nobody. But strippers, you know, strippers, I didn't, I didn't touch strippers nobody. Strippers job though. Because if you look at it, yeah. Right. That's occupation though. Strippers <laughs> but, but, they have jobs. They make a lot, so, lot of money. Come on now, so, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> they you, make you, a lot of money. Yeah, like. She working. Come on, she working right now. It ain't like she was negative. Did you have a good time though? What? Damn. <laughs> Come on, B. Hey, bro was living. <laughs> hey, you know the best part for me though. The best part, bro, was after it happened, went down. You went on live again. And oh, yeah. oh yeah, bro was like, There's another it's, I got something else yeah, coming. Oh, I got something oh, coming. Oh, we think it's over, nigga. We going back in. Yeah, we was like, okay, what do you yeah. want to do? What do you want to do, bro? Oh, tell you. <laughs> but bro. you know what though? On ESPN, I gotta keep it 100 though, dog. I was, I was upset. Not upset, but I was mad that they fired him because. And we all had great careers. Now, I probably had the best career out of all of us. But anyway, that's not story. <laughs> Even you put you including the truth? No, no, no. The football dudes. Oh, the football dudes. <laughs> but no, I'm serious. He don't always be biased and so He posted though. Yeah, right. Right. That's shady. Yeah, yeah, right, right. Uh, no, numbers say it. We number, argue, we argue numbers. Let's not argue that. Let's not argue that. that. Anyway, ESPN, why, why I was mad that when you got fired is because players that have great careers, like, unless the, the analysts really do their homework and study it, I don't even respect a lot of them dudes' words when they speaking on sports because, like, if he say it, it's gonna mean more. It's gonna yeah, right, mean more, right? 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 Because right, right, right. I said he said some up. stuff before. I'm like, yo, it might be controversial, or whatever. But when he said, right. you gonna pass some words like, oh yeah, well, right. truth said it, so right. maybe there's something to it. You know what I'm saying? A like, more to it. But we're in a situation in the air now. It's entertainment. Mm, it it's about entertainment. Like NBA is an entertainment company now. NFL is entertainment. Explain that. Explain that. Explain that. It's what you mean by that? Company. No, that's what they label it. They're LLC. Like their, oh, their right. companies are entertainment. Yeah. They, 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 they NFL, NBA, entertainment now. Mm. So they don't have to know the game as long as they can be entertaining. I guess the, the analysts. You got to balance the two. Right? You got to you yeah. have to balance the two. You got to spit facts, but you got to understand it's entertainment. Okay. See, that's different you for know, me because I'm just coming out of playing. Like, y'all, you've been doing a little more and you into it now. See, so for me, like, that's the side of it I'm starting to learn now because it's like yeah. me being a player, I'm not looking at how you looking at it. Like, now he on the other side of the city. Like, hold on. You sitting there talking. You don't know. I know football. Yeah. Like, how you going to act like you know football? Like, I didn't play. I'm a Hall of You finna say, so it's like, yo, shit, like, it's not, you don't have no credibility. You hear, you hear DJ. Hey, you hear DJ. Nah, for hey, real, hey, bro. Hey, like, hey, it's hey, I'm a Hall yo, of Fame. Hey, hey, I hate, come I hate, on. I hate, I hate, I hate bomb. Now, this is my issue, though. Cause you played and you was on the, the the corporate side. Like, what about bums giving a perspective on good players? Well, it, it don't matter. You in it, you win it. Okay. You, you did it. Who the bums? Oh, hold on, now. Cause y'all, I ain't gonna lie, who the bums? To me, it ain't no bums. That's not true. No, Ooh. but listen though. Listen though. Who the bums? <laughs> you That's ain't no bums. <laughs> no, no, no. But this is the I thing. Watch you I don't get, consider. Uh, 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 what's the bum dude name? The point guard. A bum as compared to what? Think about it this. If you the worst not, player, the worst player in the NBA is better than everybody else. Do do you think you'll ever go back to ESPN, another network, or those do you uh, want Right now I'm doing work, I'm doing some work with Showtime basketball. Me and KG nice. do our thing yeah. once a week. Do a we talk hoops. Too, we talk hoops. And uh, you know, I'm gonna be doing some stuff with them surrounding boxing too, because I'm a big boxing fan. Me I've been too. going to fights. My whole life, I used to go to all the Floyd fights, Oscar De La Hoya, and so I'm be doing some stuff with them. I do work with uh, the Celtics still, I'm going to Boston. I, I mean, I, I got my hands in a little bit of every, right. everywhere right now. So the key for me is just I stay busy, you know. Did, did you like it though? What? Like working with ESPN? It was cool. It was it was just I didn't know what I wanted to do when I retired. Right, right. That's yeah. You, you know what I'm saying? So like, 
my last few years in the league, I was working the finals. And so, you know, I was doing the, the games in the finals while I was playing. And so it was like when I retired, they was like, you want to, you know, come on full time. Right. And I was like, yes, yeah, something. <laughs> That's something I can do, you know what I'm saying? I did it for the last couple of years, and so it was cool, you know, so just to just get that ex experience and, and doing that, because I like talking sports. Yeah. You know, it come natural for us. It's locker room. Yeah, right, right, yeah. Right. yeah I love like, it. I love even, it. like I said, we sit in the locker room after practice and be sitting here doing this. That's right. That's right. You know what I'm saying? For like another hour or something after, before you go home. It's so it come now. Like the basketball real quick. I, I wanted like the truth. You told me yeah. how he got the name. I ain't know Shaq gave him the name. Two, tw 2001. Shaq named everybody. The only two thousand. Yeah. It was two thousand one. Because right? that's that's one of the hardest. Is that not top five? Uh, yes. uh, nicknames. Top five nicknames in all the sports. <laughs> you got Prime. You yeah. got Truth. That's cool. Who else you got? Cause like, is a, a bucket though. Yeah, Shaq gave me that when I came yeah, to LA. I came to Staples and I dropped like forty two on him, and I think we won that game. And he saw me giving cold buckets. And so after the game, he went to the reporter and was like, you know, I knew he was good, but I didn't know he was that good. You know, just, I think this is my third year or something like that. And he said, he the mother truth. That's how he said it. Yeah, yeah. You know, he said, he the mother truth. And so the next day, the beat writer put it in the newspaper. So it was all in Boston. He was like, the truth prevails or some, something like that. And so, you know, I didn't know he said it, but then next thing I know, everybody calling me truth. And I'm like, Oh, okay. Yeah. I, 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 can, I can rock with this. Yeah. You know, everybody was just like, hey, what's up, Truth? And I'm like, what? And they showed me the article. And I was like, all right, damn. Ain't, you that, know? ain't that one of the best feelings in sports, bro? Like when you make it and then you get to sign off of one of the goats and the legends. Like when they say, Some, yeah, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you get a sign that had off. to be one of the If you get a sign moments. off from Diesel, right. I mean, Shaq. come on. He, you know, it's hard to get his props. But right. wasn't that when he played with y'all? Because he keep, did he, he play with y'all? He came late. He late, came later, though. Dirty. This was like, he was, yeah, he was I had him my washed. third year. He was washed. Yeah, he was done. Well, he, he was done. 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 He was He was done. He was done. He was done. He was done. But I, I want to go back, bro. He played at Kansas, man. Kansas, Kansas University, bro. Like that's one of the best. I think top ten, top yeah, five Kansas universities. Right. They do be nice. Though. Like com, coming from be. LA, like what was they LA experience right. like for you, bro? Like I, I want to know because that's big time basketball. Yeah, yeah. But it, it, it was more than just you know going to Kansas, like like, going, like, like how you leave UCLA Uber. though. That's what no, I'm look, saying. So like, like coming out of USC, Uber, they paid him more. No, they didn't pay me more. But like coming out of the wood, yeah, yeah, coming out of the wood, right? Yeah. So I was getting in all type of trouble, Jack. I was hanging with the cast that Same I'm. Same reason why with. I didn't go to cast. I know. You so know we talk talk about that. Let the people hear. And so, you know, it was, it was a point to where it was one class I needed to pass to go to college to be eligible for college, where I was going to JC. Mm -hmm. The teacher failed me initially, so I had to beg him. I remember begging him, and I'm like, "Look, I'm not coming back here." I need you to give me a, a D <laughs> just so Seriously. I can get out of out of here. I'm not coming back. I know I probably turned you off or something, but I understood who I was. And I was like, if I stay home in LA, I'm gonna be running with the wrong crowd. I'm gonna be getting in trouble. That's surreal, bro. And you know, yeah. UCLA was a powerhouse. USC yeah. was good. Yeah. I could have easily stayed home. <laughs> Friends and family followed me. But I went, I went to Kansas to visit and I looked. It was uh, nothing to do. I was like, this is where I need to go yeah, right here. Lock in. This yeah. is where I need to go right here. You was locked in back then like that. I I, I knew myself. I said, to. yeah, yeah. I was like the way we was raised. I mean, when you when you lose homies, when you got when you lose yeah. teammates to gun violence or gang activity, go to jail, when you see that constantly around you, you don't want to be around. If I got a chance to get away from that, yeah. I got a chance to That's get away from that. that. How, 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 how is it out here? Did they take care of y'all? Like, you know, were, were we? Man, talk about that. Talk, talk about that. Go yeah, ahead, Did they B. take care of you knowing that? Like, okay, that's growing up. I don't up, know if you ain't had a loose. truth back then, but like, yo, that's the truth. Make sure he good. He get a pass, walk through. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, that's like, hood what? culture. That's hood culture yeah, right yeah. there. Yeah. So, you know, the top player in sports, you black in the hood, you're going to have the gangsters looking out for you. You know, they might even get you some shoes yep, yep. Or, or something. That's that's just our hood culture. You know, when you that dude in, right. in, the, in the hood. And so I had, you know, neighborhoods that looked out. They know when I came to the park, you know, don't 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 fuck with him. That's you know, he gonna make it out. Yeah. So they did everything to protect you. You know, you wouldn't you didn't have to fight the OGs. They was making sure you were straight. Yeah. I mean, it was one time I got into it uh, with some gangsters at the park, and it was like. And then the OG Darby came over Park. here, uh, uh, Rogers. Rogers, Park. <laughs> Rogers. Park. And so the big homie came up like, nah, you, he, he go to Inglewood. Don't you know? Don't yeah. fuck with him. 
You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, but that's that's hood culture. Y'all, y'all, I know y'all, huh? So Kansas was the play to so get Kansas away. So Kansas was the play to get away. away. Even in the summer, I come home for one week, say hi to moms, I'm back out in Kansas, summer school, working out. A lot of players like that out here, though, from, from Cat, like uh, the Black Mamba. I, I was, when I was with the Chiefs, he was telling me how, he like. About, uh, he talking about De'Anthony Thomas, his little bro. He, he kept talking about how. Oregon. He went, I'm like, why you go to Oregon, dog? Because <clears throat> he, he Snoop Dogg was promoting them, all them dudes. And he was like, yeah, I want to get out of LA, bro, because I knew if I was around certain dudes, people want this, want right. that from me. Right. That's our story, bro. That's yeah. what we, we all do that, bro, including myself, right. bro. I'm going to ask you this because I'm a huge fan of, of basketball and all sports. But like you know, at football, we think we know all the basketball. You know what I'm saying? And we really, we really don't. Like we know, but we don't know because you in the locker room. Right, right. Who, who's probably the, um, when you play? I don't want to talk about now. I'm talking about when you, in your era. Yeah. Who was probably the most underrated player? Right? Like, like. Okay. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. To the yeah. world, he won't be a. But you might be like, man, this motherfucker, he bring it. Underrated. And then somebody that was overrated. Uh, Two of them. You know what I mean? One of each category. Okay, so my underrated. Who my underrated? It could be score, it could be guarding you, defense. Underrated, somebody who I matched up with. I, I don't think. Uh, to me, mellow, dog. Carmelo. No, listen, though, no, listen. I'd rather guard LeBron, Kobe, T Mag oh. before Melo. Mm. Dog. That's gonna go back. Hold on. Why is that? Why dog, is that? Cause oh. just, just how dog, he used to hurt my chest. Like, cause he just he he bulldog. He a bulldog. Like, he gonna be physical, he gonna post you up, he gonna hit you with a shoulder in the chest, you're gonna be hurt after the game. Like, like, no, nah, dog, like mellow, like he gonna make you feel this 30. Like, you know, other cats, they gonna finesse they 30. Nah, you gonna be hurting. And like, I thought, but if you really watch him, he is That's aggressive though. But you aggressive. wouldn't expect him to be aggressive like that. Mellow aggressive. He yeah. Yeah. aggressive, boards. dog. Yeah. Yeah. Man, he gonna throw. But he's smooth too, though. though. We got we got to get the overrated because I got to I got to Who, Who's bro. overrated? Overrated that I played against. You speak your mind. You ain't nervous. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna say. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say Richard Jefferson. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, did you see that? I like it. It's funny though. He gave me that like uh, funny, I sarcastic. Know what I mean? uh, that's gonna go. That's gonna. That's yeah. gonna. That's gonna go. Yeah. He gonna post about that. Right. Okay, Paul. That's what you're saying. Put him in please. I mean, you heard me. Yeah. He did rip that D Wade though. He was overrated to the fuck. He gonna be mad. <laughs> Hey, so, so so I I got two I got two I got I got two questions, man. So one, give me your top five players in the NBA right now. I need your top five. If you if you were owner right now, who the top five top for five? sure? That's easy. Curry, for sure. Giannis, Durant, LeBron, mm. and. This fifth one gonna be tough. It's one in Philadelphia. Mm. Please don't forget oh, him. No, no, let him, let him get it. It's one in Philadelphia. Please don't forget him. I know. Oh, no, no, let him. Don't play this with my boys. This a tough one, dog. This a tough one. I don't it's, think so. It's, it's still out there. It's still, no, it ain't. Still, it is. It's, it's a boy in Philadelphia. It's some, it's, it's, he's still a few Ray. joints it's out there. It's a few there. joints. Oh, Luca? Maybe Luca. Hold on. We need his five. We yeah. need. I okay. Need let me. Okay. You said Kyrie, Giannis. No, no. I said Steph Curry. Oh, Steph Curry, Giannis. You said LeBron uh, and KD. LeBron and KD. So the fifth one. And B. <laughs> yeah, but don't make that. Don't force that in. Why are you trying to force B in? He like he just talked about his little dogs. No, no, no. I I gotta go in B. Thank you. No, 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 big bro. Philly, let's go. No, he Kansas though. He Kansas. He my Kansas dude, though. But you can't, nah, this Kansas. No, no, but he a dog. He a dog. He, he a dog. Oh, you picked this top five for no, 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 no. I mean, I could have said, like, <laughs> I could have <laughs> said Ja Morant, uh, Devin Luka. Booker. Devin Booker? No, nah, Devin Booker not Devin top Booker. five. You don't think he top five? He's not top yeah. five. Devin nice Booker, cold, bro. He cold. He cold, not five. Kawhi Leonard? I mean, Kawhi, come I mean, on, like, it's. Damon Lillard. Damon Lillard. He's in Kawhi. Kawhi not to hold on. And, and 24 months. Don't do that, bro. He's he still in 24 months. What Jack? you going to say, Andy Davis next? Let's hold on, man. Oh, my <laughs> God, bro. Y'all niggas not giving 
Respect, bro. Yeah, we are, but not top five. Luke, not Luke top up. five. And it'd be, it'd be your, Kawhi your Leonard's top five, bro. Yeah. You just saying that because you got a few injuries right been now, bro? He he said, right? Hey, hold on. You hear, we, just, we you hear this conversation? I'm Can y'all help me out over here? I'm just saying, you saying he's not just because he, he been injured played in 24 months, bro. Like, Kawhi. Oh, not Kawhi. Kawhi, he created load management. Right, he did. Nah, but he been missed time for like two years, years ago. Kawhi Leonard was the top five in the league. Are we not like? What are you talking about? Four years ago. <laughs> two years. But no, but, but, no, no, no but, not two. When he was in Toronto. Saying, what are you talking that about? Was, no, that was but, three but or Jack, four. But we said three or four. We said let him three or four. Can we look at it? Hold on, hold on. Look at it. It was nineteen. But let him get. I'm just saying, let him get his feet back under because he. Okay, but it's still stop acting like two years ago. He wasn't just. No, I'm saying. I say he's not. But you grew up with Kawhi or something. He from L.A. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. He like L.A. Yeah, What's up with you and so Kawhi, bro? Ago, he wasn't that was 2018. <laughs> <laughs> it's 2019. <laughs> You're a few years off. <laughs> <laughs> years off. But I'm saying, though, he <laughs> got damn, bro. Yo. <laughs> Kawhi a dog, bro. Is he Kawhi, not? I love see, Kawhi. See, but it, no, because y'all just trying to get on me about From Kawhi, last year, no. Though, like, I'm no. still on that. Kawhi, good. He's not top five, Jack. That's all we saying. He's not top five, six, top six, right top seven. Right now, he's playing eight. top five basketball, bro. He's not. He's not. Right, so now, the he, right now, currently, he playing top five. Yes, he is. So. And that's what I'm saying. You know why? Because right I follow, I follow, I, I, I do work for the Clippers right now. He right now, today, Thank you. he playing top that, five. And that's the what last, I'm saying. The last two weeks. The last, the last 30 games. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm kind of saying, you about, and they, you no, kind of went on their side, too, No, though, no, no, no. He not top five now, but I'm saying the last right now, third, right now top five. Top, dude, he know Kawhi. Kawhi been killing. All right, f all that, though. So, look, man, we got to go. So, so I want to talk about the wheelchair, man. You got carried off in oh, the wheelchair, Oh, that was crazy. Man. I, I, like, because, you know, Kobe, we walking off. You know, I love you, big bro, but Kobe walking off. What yeah, happened with the wheelchair? Yo, I felt bad. Kobe I thought he was going to hurt. Kobe shot the free throw on Achilles. He has to get shit, though. Yeah, but hold on. <laughs> That's cool, though. Hey, I ain't going to lie. We all been there, Can dog. Can about the wheelchair? I'm saying he has to get I just want to know. I'm we saying, talk about the way you, well, you take no, it up. No, I'm not. Yeah, that is no, I'm I, know, I know it is. I'm there, just asking. No, no, I'm saying, but there's some If I had right? to take a shot, I'd take the slowest possible route. Because you can't walk that shit off. Because you're cutting your stomach, bro. Like, you had to hold it. You can't walk that shit out there. You treat you with tire We all been there. Like, you get it. I ain't never had this shit during the game. Right. I ain't never had That's a rumor. Man, come on. I want to hear the real story, man. Give my man an opportunity to talk about it, bro. You his size. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, why Why would I have to fake an injury? Right. I'm gonna just sub out. He was like, that was a meme before. Yo, he came meme. back, he was like, yeah, we're like, what? I'm all these three. I said, oh, this is bull. <laughs> Yo, at that time, I thought the NFL was red, or the NBA was red. Hey, he came hey. back shooting all these threes. Hey, listen. I was like, come listen, on, cuz. Listen, listen. My bad. He had me mad that it's time, It's an entertainment company, right? The NBA is you an You was doing that shit way back then? <laughs> you had the script. <laughs> okay. Just like the NFL got their scripts? Break right. it down, bro. That was my script. I want to hear what happened, okay. man. Come on, break, break it down. Keep telling no, the people. No, no, I sprained my knee. I didn't ask for no wheelchair. Like, you think I said, go to the back, get the wheelchair. <laughs> like, like, come on, bro. Like, but you could have said no. Oh, yeah. You could have said no. Let me walk this shit off. I was like, I didn't even get a chance to stand up. Like, I was on the ground like, damn, my shit loose. Oh. You know, I had, I had sprained it. <laughs> and so they was like, then I got carried, and then they brought a wheelchair. I mean, come on, dog. Like, but it's like the it. whole demeanor, though, bro. You ain't had to be low, uh, <laughs> like this. He was like, he, he was, he was rubbing his head. I was like, oh, I said, damn, Paul Pierce is. Up. It did look bad, though. It, no, I look at it, it do look kind of bad, worse than it was. Yeah. I, I, I get it, and I know. Listen, though. Hey, I created something that's gonna live forever. That's so true. What? That's true. <laughs> that's true. That's good, though. The fans are screaming. Hey, listen, that's storybook. I go in the back. All right, I walk it off. I ain't had to take no. <laughs> come on, let's keep it one. Right. Come on, come on dog. I, I put a knee brace on, tested it out. I was like, this is the NBA Finals. I don't care if it hurt. I'm going back out there. The only sh I did was on the Lakers. Yes. Come on now. That's right. true. Come on now. That's definitely true, though. Let's keep it on the Lakers, man. Let's keep it. That's the only yeah. Yeah. I did. Yeah. Yeah. Over and over again. All right, so look. Now you said you was hold on. You said oh, no. you, you said you said you was paranoid uh, from the the real situation. Yeah. Um, but after that. Were you paranoid? Like anytime you tweak your ankle, mm. were you conscious? Like, let me jump up because I ain't trying to get that reaction anymore. Well, I, didn't, I was on the. If you look at it, we do the replay. We look at. It, I was on the ground, and it just felt a sharp pain. It was like a sharp pain. <laughs> 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 All right, we look. We on to something. Hey, nah, look. Yo, so, hold on, bro. Yeah, we over that. Hey, no. So look, going back. <laughs> we said. We said no. Shut up, Shane.
Oh. Hey, Keon just texted me. Oh, he Keon said, said he wanted no. Keon tell you said talk about the stain on the pants. There was a brown was no stain, stain on the pants. Y'all know that. Y'all know that. Y'all know that. They, 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 you know, no, no. Look, you know that was uh, superimposed on the computer. God, crazy. No, no. The wheelchair is stupid. And the wheelchair is in my trophy case. <laughs> Nigga, please. With the yeah, MVP period. trophy. Hey, no, hold on. So hold on. All right, <laughs> next, bro, stop. Next to the Nick ring. Zip up. Right, right, next right, to the zip ring. Up. All right, now hold on. We talking about a whole lot of shit. No, these shit my brother did, like he said, was on the Lakers. Like, I grew up a Laker fan, bro. We all know you killed us. What was it like, though? You born and raised here, bro. I keep going back. This is the city, bro. You went to Boston and played, bro. Like, that's the ultimate laker rival bro bro hate you i love you today because you big bro i couldn't hate you but i hate it when you shit on the lakers but honestly bro what, what was that like for from a kid coming from la bro and playing versus our rivals bro like that gotta sit different with you because did you i ain't never asked you this we, we've been rocking for a long time but did you grow up a laker fan hell yeah so what was, what was that like bro i mean it was it was just like i wanted to be a laker of course but you know how I go. You get you play where you get drafted to. You play where they give you that bag. I really want to know, like, what what what, a, what was it like, bro, for you being like? You know, you know what I did I after we Lakers won it. Man. You know what I did. You know I flew out here, came home. I came home to and celebrate. So, wow. To celebrate. You know the first thing <laughs> I did. I uh, I went to Katana. Mm -hmm. Right, it's packed Friday night. I bring the MVP trophy and put it outside <laughs> on the table, like boom. It's like about 15 of the homies, right. boom, flat. Like, I'm gonna put the right here so yeah. everybody can see this. Yeah. Let them see this. That's hard. Feet up. Yeah. I'm on the balcony of Katana with the MVP trophy right there. Cold. Right there on Sunset. Yeah. With all the homies. That's a boom, right boom, here. boom, yeah. That's a yeah. picture. Davo, you remember that? <laughs> hey, that's hard right there, though. What? Everybody looking. <laughs> oh, man, fuck hell. Oh, that's <laughs> I'm like, yeah, yeah, motherfucker. Top of the world. Right, right. That's I'm on cold. top of Sunset with the MVP trophy sitting outside of the patio. That's a picture. Eating. I need that. Did, it, did, it, did, it, did, it, did that flick? Did the trophy? I oh, don't know. I might got it somewhere. Did, I got the trophy did, right did there. That, did that mean something different for you, though, being a kid from LA and, and actually winning versus the Lakers? And, like, what what was that like, bro? I mean, I felt like I was on top of the world, dog. Dog. I'm going to Spain that summer. Yeah. I'm going I'm everywhere. Trying, dog. I'm like, oh, I'm. So, like, and so I go to Vegas for like a month. A month. Like a whole month. Nigga, I got me a World Wrestling Federation belt. I'm walking, <laughs> he I'm got walking the chair around. Like I got my jewels on. I got my wrestling belt on. I'm walking around whole Vegas. I'm that guy for the summer. Yeah. For one summer, I'm the guy. Yeah. Right? You know what I'm saying? So I got the belt. I'm walking around Vegas. Shirt off. Mike yeah. beater on. Sagging like, yeah. Like, yeah. Watch out. Like, watch out. I'm in the LA. club. Like, I'm in the club with the homies. Like, oh, watch out. Yeah, let's move over to VIP. Bro, move, look out. This is my spot. Right here, get out of here. Hey, you, come here. Sit on there. Yeah. Hey, you ready to make a call. In your that, friend. You in your friend. I mean, you know, you, you, that, uh, you know it's not every, that, like, yeah, I got, got a chance to sit there. For sure. And I enjoyed it. Yeah. Was that the I, highest moment you think of, of your career? Man, what? Yeah, Outside of getting drafted? Man, I'm the guy. I got the trophy. Like, no, I got I, the MVP trophy. To wrap up I'm the, the best in the world. To wrap up the show, I got a few, just a few things, like, Tell us about that that moment where you was like, damn, like I made it. Almost like yeah. starstruck in a way. Not just I just no, got I drafted. You, I know what you, you understand? I'ma say I felt like I really made it was 2000 and, and, and my third year, my fourth year again. It was my fourth year. And I made the all-star team and I'm in the layup line and I'm going my layups. I'm just, you know, I'm like, damn, that's chills going through my body. I'm in the all-star game. And so Denzel, like, hey, Pierce. I look, and I, 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 I look, I was like, I know he's, hey, Pierce. And I'm looking, it's Denzel. Right, 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 yeah. And I'm like, hold on, Denzel, no way. Like, think about it. You know, we grew up, Denzel, he that right. guy. He that dude. So when Denzel hit me with the, like, Pierce, come here. Yeah. And took a flick with him, I was like, oh, man. Oh, shit, yeah. That is big right there. No, that's, that's when you knew you made it. That's right? when I'm like, okay, I done hit like a certain level that's now. Sure. Y'all had a moment like that? No, that was In my that career. Was lit. That was yeah. Lit. I know. That's, 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 that's exactly lit. what I meant. That's why I said that's not what I'm when saying. you get dragged. I laid up. No, so when Denzel asked yeah. me for a flick, mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, damn. Yeah. Bro, I, I was had, starstruck yeah. from Denzel. This is a moment I had in my career. So, you know, I'm a diehard Kobe, like, Number one over even Michael Jordan. You can say oh, I'm crazy, Philly. but I love I, I love Kobe over anybody. Yes, sir. Bro, I had an opportunity to meet Kobe, and when I met Kobe, 
he a diehard Eagle fan, yeah, bro. Yeah, like he yeah. loved the Eagles, bro. He like D Jack. He oh, had the 10 man. jersey on. I said, oh, bro, I'm bro. up. I swear to God, bro. And then when I did the punt return versus the Giants, he actually they interviewed him. He was getting on the bus after watching, I mean, after playing the game, he watching the game, bro. And I went crazy. And he was like going back to tell him like how he remembered it. And I heard him talk about me. I said, Kobe talking about me? Oh, it's over. Remember the game? And he, he gave us <laughs> I said, it's over, bro. Like, when was the Lakers game? Then he looked he out and he off. gave us the shoe. He, he took his shoes off and gave it to him. On me. I told him, like, before the game, me and Shady, you know, we, of course, like, we young. We was out, we on the feet up. Females, I ain't, we ain't gonna use the word, but females out of everything. He came over. He was like, what's up, bro? I'm like, hey, I need them, I need them shoes after the game, bro. You know, I was like, this McCoy. McCoy, you know, I'm gonna introduce yeah. the after the game, I swear, bro. They, they That's rock. not true. I didn't, bro, I didn't say he didn't know. Yeah, man, I, hold on. Yo, that's not true. Hold on. Hold on. What are you talking about, bro? You talking about the truth. I'm just saying, I'm, I'm not calling you a liar. I'm just saying, you might not remember. It was a long time ago. Because the way I remember. That's not true. I said he came over and and I'm like, but bro, we, I said he bro, know we, you had to introduce I didn't him. Inter, I didn't say I introduced him. I said, him. We, I didn't we didn't say that. I'm just saying he shook our hands. Let me hear your version. The truth? Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. My bad. Look, so first of all, me and him sitting down, right? We see he make eye contact. We like, oh, us, Kobe, he on the other side. At halftime, bro, we didn't talk to him. Some people came over and- Who said and, we talked to him at halftime? I look, said before the game. He shook our hand before the game. What are you talking we about? We ain't talked to him before the game, bro. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, 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 is, so is after the game we talked to him? Hey, this on tape. This on tape. Bro, this shit's live. Yeah. I, I talked to him. What are you talking about? All right, well, man, all right so maybe he, all right, maybe he talked to him. I wasn't there. It's crazy. So what's the story? So wait, so wait, so what's the story? I, never, I don't even look, care look. about the story no more. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, no, I'm saying, I just, What's wrong with you? It just happened differently. You know what I mean? Oh, my stomach, dog. <laughs> oh, my stomach. That's my brother, though. It's so, all you matter, bro. Yeah, this one matter. sound better. Yeah, it sounds like he took go his shoes off right here. It was like, here, y'all. <laughs> And say he took him out. He gave him his shoes, oh, bro. I said he he signed him and gave oh. him to us. So he said game. that you said you said Mamba. that. Mamba. He didn't do that. He didn't do that. <laughs> Mamba. I didn't, say, I didn't say he did that, bro. <laughs> no, look, That's not what I said, bro. Man. I was, like, I'm telling the story about him basically explaining when we won, right, how he yeah. talked about me, bro. Yep. And then we obviously went to the game and we sitting on the course seat, bro. Tell us, tell so us, bro. I shook his hand. I don't know what he talking about. Y'all shake his hand. Yeah, bro. What's okay, up? He After went, the he game. went to the bathroom. Yeah, you, That's my you, question. Right, right, right. Hey, hold yeah. up. Oh, that, yeah, that's my thing. Yeah, I'm not upset. I love these two, dog. I'm not upset. How do we get the shoes? Listen, we drove together, right? You remember that? Bro, I don't know. It was 10 years ago. Whatever. How, okay, so we drove ago. together, though. We, we go there. We get in the seats. You know what I mean? We see Kobe make eye contact. He like, yo, what up, what up? At halftime, the equipment people, they come out and they give me and him both sneakers. Did that happen? Halftime or after the game? Halftime. At halftime. I don't remember at halftime. I don't. I don't. He don't remember that part. All right, cool. <laughs> I'm saying, so why, why was he getting shoes right here? Yes, the whole game. Right. That's yo, yo, what I'm saying. Like, time out. Hold on, hold on, real quick. So we didn't leave with the with, with box of sneakers from Kobe Bryant that well, day. So at halftime, I'm asking you a question. I'm asking you after the game. Yes. Okay. Listen. But at halftime, what do we listen, do with bro, the Listen, bro. Listen. I'm gonna say my version, and then he could continue his version. At halftime, the equipment manager, little dude, whatever. He came out. He had two boxes of sneakers. Yeah. Kobe signed them both. Right. That's when we met his 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 wife. I met his wife, and his kids was there. You know what I mean? We talking Kobe Bryant fans. She talking about he an Eagle fan, all that, all that stuff. Do you remember that part or no? Well, tell your story. Okay, <laughs> right? Because you know what I'm talking about. Tell, tell I remember story. this. So look, so then, and then after the game, we, we spoke to him. Come so on. what did I say that was wrong? What I just said, we we shook hands. I'm gonna stay out of it, Paul. What did he say? What did he say? No, no, no. Like, we got, we got shoes. Right? Little conflict. I, I ain't trying to say I'm the reason why he know Kobe. I ain't saying that. I'm just P. saying we both hollering, bro. P, come on, what, P. What, what I'm saying like, so y'all had the shoes during the game right here. At halftime, we had the shoes, bro. He, he they brought were them sitting, out. Where y'all put them? Kobe at? never physically but gave us. Where y'all put them at during the rest of the game? Just on the floor? I had them on the floor, yes. Okay. Kobe never gave us the shoes, or did he? Kobe, <laughs> of course, no. He signed them. Oh, he signed. 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 You know, I went live, you know, I didn't understand what really happened. So the next morning I wake up, I'm like, oh yeah, you know, a tough night. I wake up to a thousand messages <laughs> and me viral. So I'm like, oh, I'm like what? And so the day go by, I'm just like, oh shit, what the f happened? So it's like seven o'clock. And so I text good morning at 7 p.m. 
And that went viral on oh, Twitter. On Twitter. Twitter. Oh, hey, Twitter. On Twitter. Bro, hey, you had a rough night. It was loaded. I said good morning at 7 p.m. to Twitter. So that went viral. I was like, oh, I don't know what I did. I'm getting calls from my agent. I'm getting calls from family. I'm like, oh, I didn't realize. That damn there was a blackout night. No, I'm living with my girlfriend at the time. Who, who ju- we just had a kid. Oh, so, that's So, I mean, she, I mean, it wasn't cheating. But all, it was just, all that ass in that video? Not, it's not, that wasn't cheating. Like, it's, ain't no difference it's, it's more like, Wait, that, that's not cheating, he's right. Why are they around you? Sir? She know I'm there, though. That's not cheating, though. That's not cheating. So what was like, that? what's the difference from like that? And like, say I say we go to the strip club. Yeah, okay. I wasn't getting a lap dance. She was shaking that shit behind you, though. Yeah, okay. Yeah, she was shaking the shit out of you. All right, man. All right. <laughs> all right, man. It was love, man. <laughs> Subscribe. Come back next Monday. Appreciate Big Bro for tapping in with us finally. It took a year and it took d to get him here. Peace. We had to fight to get a meal. Yeah, wrongfully accused. We had to fight to get a pill. That's why we right to get a deal. He on the team, he gotta eat, you know. Spike, spike your skills. Fat. Keep it riding for the fam. You gotta light the wig and wheel straight up. But in the past bad, work up in the trash bag. I'll pass a lot to take the test before I pass class. Yeah, and my family needed bread. I had to come correct. That's why I keep airing it out like I just passed gas.